What is up everybody? Welcome to another brand new card opening video. This is Searching for Hits with Eric and I am Eric. Excited to bring you a video that I was hoping to have for you last week, but it got delayed in the mail. Um, I received a walk-off wax mega blaster, which uh, if you didn't see the video previously, opened one of these up a few weeks back and it was really awesome. Um, this time, uh, he, uh, Randy over at Walk Off Wax sent me some additional bonus packs, which is really cool. A couple of Donruss 88s, uh, 2019 Donruss, and a couple of Leaf 93, as well as an archive box topper. So we'll open those up and then see what is in the Walk Off Wax Mega Blaster. We do have some sleeves and some top loaders for all those hits that we'll find. So let's crack on in and see what we can do. Uh, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Uh, hit that alert button so that you know when I post new content. And let's get underway. So we'll start off with the Archives box topper. This comes in the blaster boxes of uh, Topps Archives 2020. You can get autographed versions of this occasionally. Um, I have never seen one, but um, let's see what we have here. Looks like it's going to be Bryce Harper. And it is not autographed, but there is the Bryce Harper oversized box topper. Pretty cool. Now let's crack into the packs, our bonus packs. Um, we'll start with the 88 Donruss. Not too excited about 88 Donruss, but um, really looking for the Tom Glavin rookie. Not much else of tremendous value in the 88 Donruss, but uh, still cool to look at. That's the front of the cards. That's the back of the cards. Um, starting off with Ken Griffey Sr. Ken Griffey Sr., not Jr., Junior was next year. There's a Doc Gooden, very nice. Loved Doc Gooden. Uh, Jose De Leon, Jim Morrison, Hughes, Tommy Hinzo, Dave Valley, Carlton Fisk is a Hall of Famer. Jack Morris, another Hall of Famer. Mike Brumley, got a Dwight Evans Diamond King. Gerhardt, Tommy Gregg, Scott Bankhead, and Danny Cox. So a couple of Hall of Famers and a Doc Gooden. Pretty happy with that. Let's see what's in the other Donruss pack here. Okay. Donruss gives you the old puzzle pieces. For this one, it was... Uh... Oh, Stan the Man Musel for 88. Uh, John Farrell, rated rookie. Sean Abner, rated rookie. Teddy Higuera. Don Robinson. Gagne. Ken Caminiti. Uh, that's his rookie card. Pretty cool. Ken Caminiti, unfortunately, passed away. Um, but uh, had a few really good years. Ron Guidry, um, great pitcher. Charlie Puglio, Dwayne Murphy, Randy Bush, Mike Jackson. There's a Wade Boggs MVP card. Gus Polider, Steve Bouchel, and Walt Terrell. So Wade Boggs, one of my favorite non-Mets growing up. Great hitter. All right, let's see what's in these two 1993 Series 2 Leaf packs. I uh, believe I've opened these up on the channel before, but uh, let's see what we got in here. Looking for those Frank Thomas insert cards. Okay, let's see what we got here. That's what the front of the Leaf cards look like for 93. We'll show you the back as well. Nice photo on the back. Um, in front of the hometown skylight. That's pretty cool. Paul O'Neill. We'll, uh, we'll put that aside for my cousin Joe, big Yankees fan. Harold Reynolds, um, really good commentator. Had a good playing career. Willie Banks. These cards are a little sticky. We got a John Burkett. There's another Harold Reynolds. That's... Unfortunate. Joe Gray or Grahe. Junior Felix. Uh, Omar Vizquel, great player. These cards are a little sticky. Dave Valley. Greg Myers. Jeff Gardner. Will the Thrill Clark. Got a Brett Barbieri. And a Greg Jeffries. So nothing too crazy in this pack. Let's see what's in the other Leaf pack. 
Hopefully we'll end up with a couple of hits in this video. Um, love to get two hits. Um, this pack, uh, or the walk-off wax blasters, uh, the Mega Blaster, they guarantee you at least two hits or a graded rookie or star, which is really cool. Um, great product, really, really great product. And I'll show you that box before I open it up. Um, these are sticky here, Jose Rio, Jose Lind. Ben Rivera, Charlie Huff at the very end of his career. Uh, must have been his 30th year playing or so. Guy played forever with his knuckleball. Um, Alex Cole, Tom Henke. Got a Norm Charlton. Jaime Navarro. Got a Mike Maddox. I didn't even realize he pitched for the Mets at a, for a brief stint, I guess. That's Greg Maddox's brother. Uh, Mike Moore. Gary Sheffield, one of the quickest bats in all of baseball while he was playing. Great hitter. Got Bo Jackson. Loved Bo. Bo knows baseball. I'm going to put Bo out on the screen here as well as, ah, we'll just put Bo out there. Um, liked him a lot. And Ryan Sandberg, Hall of Fame second baseman Ryan Sandberg. Nice design. I like these leaf cards quite a bit. So um, pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. Let's take a look at this 2019 uh, retail pack of Donruss Baseball. Pretty good set here, looking for the top rookies. Um, you can get autographs. Um, you want to pause it and take a look. Real tiny print, but uh, let's see what opportunities there are for inserts and autographs and parallels. Donruss, as we know, does not have the licenses, so you don't have the team logos. Um, let's take a look here. This is what the front of the Donruss 19 cards look like, and this is what the back of the cards look like. They also have the throwback designs, and it looks like we might have a some sort of a hit in here, so let's take a look. Uh, Brandon Crawford, and we got a Heath Fillmire. Heath Fillmire rookie, 2019. David Boat. We got a Jacob deGrom parallel. Um, that's a blue star parallel. It's not going to be numbered, but deGrom, one of the best pitchers, if not the best pitcher in baseball right now, um, in my humble opinion, and a parallel is awesome. Uh, Blake Snell, Adrian Beltre, future Hall of Famer. Clayton Kershaw, another future Hall of Famer. And Ramon Laureano, rated rookie. So we'll put that on the screen as well. Um, just check in the back, make sure there's nothing that I missed here. Um, no, so pretty cool. I gotta look up uh, that uh, DeGrom and see what the deal is with those blue, uh, the blue stars. Um, that's definitely a parallel. Um, I just don't know what the odds of getting one are. So we'll take a look. Um, it's actually got a different feel than the other cards. Um, that's actually, I think that might be uh, old card stock, which is pretty cool. So, definitely my favorite card so far. Let's crack on in to this beautiful walk-off wax mega blaster and see what packs we have in here. Um, really, really stock box. Very heavy this time. Um, so we'll see what's in here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great week so far. Again, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Love to have you for more videos. Okay, let's see what we got. This is a jam-packed box. Oh, and that feels like a slab card. Oh, that might be something really, really, really good. Ooh, I'm excited about that. Let's see what that looks like afterwards. Um, let's take a look at what packs we got. We got an, uh, 2019 Diamond Kings. Um, that's a retail pack, I believe. We have a, an 88 Fleer, an 86 Tops, an 89 Bowman. We got a 2020 Series 2, looking for that Luis Robert. Uh, Tops Chrome, love Tops Chrome. We'll probably save that for towards the end. Uh, nice 2020 Bowman, very nice. A big league, 
Um, very underrated set. I love Big League. And a 19 Heritage. So some really good stuff here. Let's start off with the older stuff, and then we'll crack into the newer. Um, we'll start off with the 88 Fleer, see what we got here. Uh, 88 Fleer, not a whole lot of value to 88 Fleer. Um, still cool design, um, looking for the Hall of Famers, looking for Glavin. Um, let's see what we got here. That's what the front of the card looks like. Not one of my favorite designs, um, the back of the card. Got a Jerry Brown, Greg Jeffries, Devon White. Chris James, Nelson Liriano, uh, Steve Staniak, Charles Hudson, Mike Lavalier, Frank Viola, got a checklist, Ernie Witt, Ross Jones, Tony Pena had a great career, Dwight Evans as well, Bob McClure, and the Fleer Reds sticker. So nothing too crazy in that pack. Uh, let's take a look at, um, I like the 86 a lot. So let's look at the Bowman searching for the Griffey. Um, you also have the Smoltz rookie in here, Brady Johnson. Um, all the Junk Wax era is going nuts now. So um, last I saw, the Griffey was going for quite a bit, um, even some of the others. And as you can see, the gum got Jeff Parrott pretty bad. Good thing it's not a Griffey. So let's see who we got here. Um, Bowman, throwback to the old school cards, oversized top to bottom. There's the back, breaking it down by team. Um, that's Manny Trio right there. We got Mel Stottlemyre Jr. That's his rookie card. Didn't really have a, too great a career. Did last around for a while. BJ Serhoff, Pat Clements, um, Alan Anderson, there's that Jeff Parrott. We got a Duke Snyder throwback card. Wally Joyner had a nice career. Dave Smith, uh, for all you Mets fans like me, we do not particularly like Dave Smith. Chet Lemon, Pedro Guerrero, and Mike Flanagan, and Mike McFarland. So um, nothing really in that pack. Let's see what we got in 86. 86 is off the charts in terms of value. Um, the Sandberg now, PSA 10, is going for over $1,000, which is crazy. Um, all the major stars in here are off the charts valuable right now. Um, 86 was notorious for not being in the greatest condition and having centering issues. It's also got the black border, which makes it very difficult to find a highly graded card. So that's what the front of the, of the card looks like back of the card. Um, really one of my favorite sets. I like 86 quite a bit. Let's see who we can pull. As you can see, this Rick Sutcliffe is pretty badly off-center, top to bottom and left to right. Randy Reddy, Dave Smith again, of course. We got a Brett Saberhagen all-star card, which is nice. We got a record-breaking Doc Gooden card, which is very nice. We'll throw that on screen. That's pretty well-centered. Got a turn back the clock of Frank Robinson and Dennis Rasmussen took the gum. There's our spring fever. Would love to find a Sandberg um, or a Nolan Ryan or any of those other major hits. Steve Garvey, Ron Davis, Rob Deere, Mark Bailey. There's a nice one. Ozzie Smith, Hall of Famer, Wizard of Oz. Um, pretty well centered. Um, tiny bit of scuff in the black, but uh, still a nice card. We'll put that on screen. We got Ho Luis de Leon, Jim Sunberg, not Sandberg, and Doug Corbett. So not much else in there outside of those. Still fun to look at though. All right, let's get into the newer packs and see what we have here. We'll start off with 2019 Diamond Kings. Uh, I'll show you what the odds are. All these newer cards, you have all these different opportunities for numbered cards and autographs and parallels and so forth. So let's see what we can find in here. Again, thank you so much for watching. Hope you're having a great Tuesday and start to your week. Okay, right off the top, we got an Aaron Nala, great pitcher for the Phillies. We got a Kevin Kramer, 
Got a nice Babe Ruth. We got an upside down card. What do we have here? Uh, that is a crowning moments insert card of Paul Goldschmidt. Um, would have been nice if it was an autograph, but definitely an insert card. So pretty cool. We'll put that on screen. Got a Mike Piazza flashback card. Very nice. Crowning moment flashback. Al Simmons, Miggy, future Hall of Famer, and Vladdy Sr., who is a Hall of Famer. So, nothing too crazy. Uh, Got to see about that Paul Goldschmidt card. Um, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about the cards, what your favorite card is. Uh, so far, it's definitely going to be that DeGrom for me, but we do have that mystery bonus hit there. So, looking forward to that. There's a uh, 2020 Series 2. Let's see what we got in this pack. Looking for parallels, autographs, anything that we can find. We got uh, Brandon Nimmo right on top. Um, nice clean design. Love 2020 tops. Series 2, looking for Luis Robert. That's the big hit. Um, Ozzy Albis. We got Salvi Perez. Mark Mark Kana, Austin Romine, Michael Brantley, Lance McCullers, Delino DeShields Jr., Adam Eaton, J.A. Happ. We got a Future Stars of Brendan Rogers and a Warriors of the Diamond Max Scherzer insert. Uh, Scott Oberg and Rymel Tapia. Uh, nothing too crazy in here. I um, guess my favorite cards are going to be that uh, that Nemo and uh, perhaps the the War card. So, moving onward to Big League. Um, I like Big League a lot. Um, bought a bunch of this when it first came out. Um, got a couple autographs out of it. Um, they do have those parallels. Um, there's the odds right there for you of pulling those autographs and foils and so forth. Uh, let's see what we got in this. Most of the major rookies are also in this set. Um, there's the front of the card and this is what the back looks like. Uh, Anthony Rendon, Freddie Freeman, our MVP for the National League this year. Griffin Canning, got a Juan Soto. Juan Soto, one of the biggest names. Tim Anderson, former batting champion. Charlie Blackman and a Whit Merrifield orange parallel. Pretty cool. We'll put that on screen. Hunter Renfro, Mike Fears, and Christian Walker. So no hits, nothing crazy. Um, just checking the back here. Nothing too exciting. So a couple of packs left before we get to the walk-off wax bonus hit. Let's look at this heritage. We're looking for uh, limited tops player story booklets. Um, they do have hits in here, autographs, and so forth. Um, tops Heritage 2019 is paying homage to the 20 uh, to the 1970 design cards, which were really nice looking cards like that design a lot. Um, this is what the front looks like and the back looking just like 1970. Uh, we got Jared Hughes, we got Ben Zobrist, J.P. Crawford, we got a rookie card of Ranger Suarez and Eniel De Los Santos, not one of the bigger rookies. Uh, we got a then and now Chris Davis and Harvin Killenbrew. Jorge Alfaro Gold Cup card, Chris Stratton, Freddie Peralta, and a saved by the Bell, Cody Bellinger. So, again, not finding too much in terms of hits, but that can all change very quickly. Uh, 2020 Bowman, really, really nice set. Like 2020 Bowman a lot. Let's see what we got in here. For those who are interested, um, actually the odds are not on this. Um, yeah, so 
Let's see what we got here. All right, uh, we got Jose Altuve. Um, we got a Luis Robert. Best card in the set. Love to see that. We'll get that sleeved up immediately. Luis Robert Bowman. We'll put that front and center as that is definitely the best card so far. Let's see what else we got. Um, Austin Nala. That's Aaron Nala's brother. Rookie card. Ryan Ralson. Josiah Gray. CJ Abrams. Nice prospect. Now we get into our Chrome cards. We got Alec Manoa. And Christian Pache. Very nice. Shohei Otani. And Lucas Giolito. So nice pack there. Um, I like that Pache as well. So we'll put Pache out on the screen. Um, nice pack. Very nice pack. Very happy with that one. And now we'll do our Tops Chrome. Um, good chances at getting an auto in Chrome. Um, Tops Chrome is just a beautiful, beautiful product. I'll show you what the odds are right there. If you want to freeze that and take a look. Okay, right on top, we got a Jacob deGrom. Beautiful. Love Jacob deGrom. Put that right next to his other card. We got a Sean Murphy, Marcus Simeon, and a JV Justin Verlander Refractor. Nothing too crazy. No hits so far. But that brings us to this. Not sure what's in here. Um, can't tell if it's a... PSA or if it's something else. So let's uh, let's just crack on into this and see what we got. Um, I actually have to use the uh, the scissors. It looks like. So let's see what we got in here. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Again, hit that like and subscribe button. Let me know what you think. What your favorite card is. This is a 9.5 tops update. Will Smith rookie card. Um, not too bad. Um, anything graded is nice. Will Smith rookie card. Um, Beckett graded. Gem Mint 9.5. So, not too bad. Um, I will uh, certainly say, again, this is one of the best products on the market. And uh, overall, I think I got my money's worth. Certainly happy with that Luis Robert and the Jacob deGrom and uh, anything graded rookie is nice. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And we will see you next time on Searching for Hits with Eric. Have a great rest of your week.